Hey guys, happy Friday! Woo! It is 2.21 in the afternoon. Right now we are heading to Walmart to pick up some stuff for a fun little evening we're having. Josh and I are trying to make friends. Mm -hmm. We're really trying, you guys. We have friends, I swear. It's just they all are a little ways away now. Mm -hmm. We're trying to make friends that live close as well. Tonight we are going to a beach and there's this one beach that has fire pits. So we're going to Walmart to pick up some s'more stuff and some firewood. We invited some new potential friends, so hopefully people show up. Yeah. Or and it could be just the two of yeah, us. Yeah, if not, it's just a cute little date night. Do you like the cinnamon graham crackers? I'm more of a regular guy, but if you want those. No, I don't like the cinnamon ones with s'mores, but do you just like oh. them in normal life? I don't think so. Oh, they're good. I'm not really a cinnamon guy. Hey. Made with real honey. Mm, yeah. Smears. These are cool, but Josh thinks they're gonna be too hard to roast. Be harder to roast, and they're twice as much. All right, let's get these. That's such a good deal. Yeah, it's so cheap. Do we need two? Well, two will go for longer because it's more wood. <laughs> Walmart is the best. The, this 188 for a four pack of campfire roasting sticks. Three bucks for a strap for your car. That is nuts. Well, that was super successful. Yeah, Walmart's the best. Also, do we show them the lighter? Picked up another lighter because the one that we have at home that we always use for our candles and stuff, I don't like the, the little lighters. They freak me out. So we always get like the long nosed candle lighters. We just picked up another one because the one we have at home is almost out. But we paid like $4.50 or something for that at a CVS. As we were at Walmart, we were in the camping section and I saw a lighter for 88 cents. You guys, these are so good. No, they're not, they're horrible. <laughs> we can't stop eating them. We picked up the Jet Puff Heart Mallows, the strawberry flavored. They're so cute because they're little heart shapes for Valentine's Day. You know how strawberries and cream taste delicious together? That's what this is. That is so cute. Josh even likes him and he doesn't even like sweet things very yeah. much because they're not overly sweet because they're just marshmallows. I love marshmallows, but. I've had like 17. Yeah, <laughs> they're so good. Every time I take a bite though, Josh, what song have I been singing? She's a heartbreaker. <laughs> <laughs> My mind go, she's a heartbreaker. <laughs> I'm so funny. What a kook. <laughs> Struggles. Ah! You guys are just trying to find lighting. Yay! That's better. So I just found a steal of a deal on a paddleboard. <laughs> it was a hundred bucks and it's a pretty sweet paddleboard. It needs a little fixing up, but luckily I can do that. It's 11 feet long. So it's strapped on the roof right now, but it wouldn't fit in my surf racks because they're made for surfboards, not paddleboards. I had these cheapy straps from Walmart that I was trying to like strap the board on with. And the guy, he owns this place called Paddle Surf Warehouse in Costa Mesa. Check it fun. out. They actually have their own line of paddle boards called Vessel. Anyway, check it out. The guys are awesome. And yeah, they were super nice. He like sees me struggling to put this paddleboard on the car and he's like, hey, I'll just make your life way easier and give you some straps that I've got in the back. So he gave me these really nice surf straps and it was way easier to cinch it onto the car. So check them out if you're in need of a paddleboard because that was pretty cool. We just made it to the beach. There are still campfire pits available, plenty. So that's good. I think we're gonna get set up and there's this really good Thai place that we've had that I think we're gonna meet up with our friend Gerard. You guys have met Gerard. Do you remember Gerard? Comment down below if you remember our videos with Gerard when he came to visit us in New Zealand. So I think we're meeting up with him to get some Thai food for dinner before doing our little bonfire. Y'all, yeah. look at this bus. So sick. Oh. That is all of my dreams in a vehicle. Oh, we came out to the pier and it's so beautiful, but it's so windy. <laughs> and so I'm freezing right now, but it's really pretty. We had some time before dinner, so we're just walking around. How beautiful is that? There are some kids out in the water right now with just their board shorts. Kids are great. Yeah, I don't know how they're doing that. We're at Mint Leaf Thai, which is delicious. We've been here before. Good Thai food is always a good time. Oh yeah, Gerard's not joining because he got caught up doing something, so. Just the two of us, a little date. I got chicken teriyaki and Josh got yellow curry, right? Yum, oh yes. Her sauce is delicious, I just ate one of her broccolis. Mm-hmm. Oh, delicious. We made fire. Good job, buddy. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> so excited for s'mores. 
Good morning, mister. Good morning. What are you doing? I'm fixing my paddle board. I have some epoxy solar resin. So you just put it on and then it cures in the sunlight. There were like two spots that had some cracks in it. So I sanded it down and now I'm just putting the resin on. Then it will cure in the sun and be waterproof. This is the little crack. So I sanded it down and then I put a little bit of resin on there and then you just gotta let it dry. Hey guys, it's a little bit later. We've just been having a super chill day. We went on a little walk together and it's been a very nice Saturday. In about an hour, Gerard is coming over and we're gonna have a little game night. So I wanted to make a little treat. I've been thinking about these monster cookies that my mom used to make. They're like peanut butter and oatmeal and they were super, super good. So I looked up a recipe and I'm gonna try to make some. <laughs> We'll see how it goes because I've never actually made them, but it can't be bad, right? It's just peanut butter, right? Probably not. <laughs> All right, so we've got butter, baking soda, vanilla, eggs, chocolate chips, peanut butter, oatmeal, brown sugar, white sugar, and M&Ms. It says to use mini M&Ms, but we don't have those and we do have peanut M&Ms, so we're just gonna go with that. Also, this recipe is gluten-free, so if you can't have gluten, it's perfect. We're gonna do peanut butter, brown sugar, white sugar, and butter. I'll put the recipe, I just got it off of Pinterest. I'll put it down below if anyone wants to try it. I'm gonna preheat the oven to 350. Ah! This is going well. We're doing okay over here. Done with sugar. vanilla and baking soda. Eggs. Next. Boom. That is a lot of oats. Yum. The batter is super thick though, so I would not suggest doubling this because my mixer is struggling because it's so thick. Smells like PB. Dough taste test, very important. Mm. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna give myself another spoon. <laughs> That's good. The dough gets a thumbs up. Yum. You guys, this recipe is a win. Try it out. I'll link it below. So good. It's so good. I love them. And I love you. Aw, I love you. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. You guys are great, and we'll see you guys on Monday. Bye. Bye. You guys are tall. Wow. <laughs> no. Two things I love, fires and beaches. Okay, okay, okay. I'm not pleased with this lighting. Yeah. That's not it. Yum, yum. Frank.